Hey guys, Mike in the Woods here. I was uh, watching Darwin on the Trails video recently about the Katadyne Beef Free versus the Sawyer Squeeze. And when he was talking about the cons of the Katadyne, uh, one of the things he mentioned was the fact that it didn't have much compatibility with common bottle types used by backpackers. And then I had a beautiful thought. I can fix that with the power of 3D printing. So I designed a custom adapter that basically mounts the Katadyne filter to a Powerade bottle. And before we get started, you know the drill, subscribe if you're new here, and let's get into the video. When I started this, the mission statement was pretty clear. I wanted to be able to attach my Katadyne water filter to a common bottle type to help fix the compatibility weakness for people who use the Be Free. It's one of the most popular water filters out there on the trail, and this was my way to try and help make it even better. So I got to work. I first checked Thingiverse to see if anyone else had the idea first, and I did find this very useful adapter that lets you mount a Katadyne water filter to a smart water bottle, the same kind that the Sawyer Squeeze is naturally compatible with. So I printed off a quick one to test. Sure enough, plugs right in with minimal effort, works perfectly. But I wasn't happy just with what other people have done. I set my sights on another common bottle type that I personally frequently use when backpacking, Powerade bottles. So I got to work 3D modeling one that could adapt the Katadyne water filter to a Powerade bottle. And much like the smart water bottle adapter, this one worked out pretty well. With my prototype, unfortunately it leaks at the base where it screws onto the bottle, which is dangerous because of contaminated water concerns. But after applying some electrical tape to make a makeshift o-ring, it sealed it up enough to prevent leaking while squeezing the bottle. I prefer the Powerade bottles to the smart water bottles as the Powerade bottles have larger mouths, which makes it much easier to fill up from, from a water source. But on the flip side, the smart water bottles do seem more durable, and I have had the Powerade bottles break and split on me. During testing, one unfortunate problem was made pretty clear. With the adapter, it has to stick up enough to give the Katadyne's filter cartridge enough space on the top of the bottle since it won't fit through the bottle mouth. As a result, it kind of sticks up awkwardly and makes the bottle super tall, and it also makes it a structural weak point, so when you're holding it, you have to be careful not to hold the bottle by the adapter and tilt it, even if it seems convenient. There's no real way to deal with that, unfortunately. It's just a consequence of trying to adapt a filter to a bottle it wasn't designed to fit in. But on the plus side, it's relatively light. It is an extra piece of gear that you bring with you, but at least it doesn't add much at all in terms of weight penalty. Overall, I'm actually really happy with how this thing turned out. So much so that I'm actually including one of these in my backpacking loadout from now on, as my setup actually involves a Katadyne Be Free and Powerade bottles. And it seems like a useful piece of kit for me to have if my Katadyne bladder springs a leak. I think I'm going to be extremely thankful I have one of these in the future when that inevitably happens. The success of this prototype has given me the idea of a few other water filter adapters, such as a Powerade bottle adapter for a Sawyer Squeeze, Powerade bottle adapter for a Life Straw, I want to be able to mount a Sawyer Squeeze to a Katadyne style bladder. I want to mount a Life Straw to a Katadyne style bladder. And I want to be able to mount a Life Straw on a Sawyer Squeeze compatible model. Check back in the description of this video periodically as I'll actually add links to the additional adapters as I make them. So will these adapters be of any use to you guys? I really wanted to make something useful for the backpacking and backcountry camping community with this one. So let me know in the comments if you would make use of one of these. Or if there's a specific filter adapter you need that I didn't mention, please let me know and I'll look into making it. If you want one of these Powerade to Katadyne filter adapters, I'll leave a link to it in the description of the video, as well as a link to the 3D model file itself if you want to print one off for yourself. If you're new to the channel, I take a look at how fun futuristic technology, just like 3D printing, can intersect with traditional outdoors experiences. So consider checking out my other videos and subscribing because I, I really think you'll love my channel if you found this video intriguing. That's me for now, guys. Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video and I'll catch you next video.